Well, hello, it's Loring, your independent Scentsy consultant. Today, I'm really excited to share with you our Scentsy family reunion haul. Both my husband and I went, so we both got equal items. And so I'm going to be sharing with you one set of the items that we got. So we did get two sets. And surprisingly, I thought that he was just going to willingly give me all of his items since I am the Sensi Consultant and it seems like he doesn't seem to care about this stuff usually. However, in this instance, he doesn't want me to touch his items. Therefore, his stuff is his stuff. I don't know what he plans to do with it all, if he's going to use it or what. Down to the catalogs. He is keeping all of his Sensi items he loves them, he wants them, he's going to keep them. So, I'm going to share with you everything that we got. It is so exciting, it is so fun. I think it is a fun part of family reunion, and I am here for it. So the first item we got was this backpack. Now, I totally used mine. His is more nice and neat, because he promptly put his away, and his is perfect, but mine is kind of used up. I totally used it. We went to Universal and Disney and all over the place and I used mine everywhere. So much so that I kind of ripped mine. And this is actually kind of a nice little backpack. It's got some good storage area in here. And I even lost an item in there. I was like, where did I put that item? So it's got a nice pocket inside. It says Scentsy right on up here. And so that was really cute. So we got a nice backpack. Let me put this aside. And then we got this really cute Scentsy Charm Clip. Woohoo! It's really cute. It is a star in the scent exclusive scent called Scentsy Sunshine and that was exclusive only to uh, Scentsy Family Reunion for this year. It was a pretty nice scent. Let's see if I can get this to focus. It's really cute, this little uh, bottom area here. Ah! If I can get it to focus. This is so cute. This little license plate here. Give it a minute. This thing takes a minute to, to focus on up. I always thought I got this little camera, it would be faster. So there you go, look at it, it says sunshine. And it's so cute, just like the bigger license plates that we got. And it's got these cute little beads and this nice tassel. And it's a cute fluffy plush star that is in the Scentsy Sunshine scent so really really cute i haven't decided where i want to put that yet so i'm keeping it in here to retain the smell until i figure out what i'm going to do with it and then the next item i'm going to show you is let me pull up this box here we got a petite pumpkin mini warmer so so cute and I had already put it together. It looks like this, not turned on, but I'm gonna plug it in for you guys. Let me get it closer. Oh, let me get some more light over here. See if we can see the light up there. This is so cute. This, this coloring is of like the uh, I have a jack-o'-lantern from Scentsy, and it is so beautiful when it is plugged in. You can put different light bulbs. Here, I'm going to turn this sideways to put this in. <gasps> Got it on. Ah, everything's a little bit tangled up there, but can you see that? Let's see if I can turn this light here so you can get a better look. Is, isn't that so cute? Now, I have heard that 
several consultants decided to start pulling their Halloween and fall stuff out because when they came back from Sensi Family Reunion, they were going to start decorating for fall. Now, I am a summer girl, and I love the summer and sunshine and all that good stuff. I do love the fall and fall decorating, but I am going to wait just a tad bit longer. But this will actually be my first item, and I'm going to put this in the kitchen for now um, as my first fall item. It'll stay there until I'm completely ready. Probably, I'm probably going to slowly transition over. As a Disney girl, I guess I do have to start uh, fall decorating because all the Disney parks, including Disneyland, Disneyland has started to decorate for fall earlier in August now. So that is going to happen. Anyways, this is so adorable. We got this as a giveaway. The next thing we got, now I don't want to go over any of the scent stuff until, until, um, let's see, well, until towards the end so I can describe them more. The next thing I got that is real exciting is the new Scentsy Go. Now, they have done some stuff in the catalog where the Scentsy Goes are now, I'm pulling up the catalog, are now going to be discontinued. So if you want them, you got to get them in August. So this is the new Scentsy Go in the catalog. And what's cool about this is, this cute Scentsy Go, is you can use two AA batteries. Now this is gonna be perfect for me because I have an entryway that has no plugs and I always wonder, oh, I, I put like fragrance flowers there, but I don't ever think they're strong enough. Um, so I think this would be perfect. I can put it right in the entryway and if somebody's gonna come over, I can get the batteries in there and turned on before they come over so they, they can get a nice beautiful whiff. Now. You can also plug it in. I have the plug around here somewhere. Shoot. It is a um, USB. There it is. Here's the plug. It's a USB plug. You can keep it plugged in if you want, but if you need to use a battery with it, uh, you can. Now, the batteries go here on the bottom. I just pulled, I found a couple batteries. I'm gonna put them in here so I can start using this really soon. And, and this is the top part. You take it off and you can see the little fan in there. That light gets me so I'm gonna turn away. There's where the fan is. Let me see if I can turn it on. Let me find the on off switch. This is my first time utilizing this. There's gotta be an on off button here. Oh, is it up here? Uh, somewhere. <laughs> Give me just a minute. You would think, oh, maybe it has to be closed. Oh, it's on already. Maybe. Oh, when this is open, it's off. And when you close this, it's on. So there, that is really, really cute. And I wonder if in the future, they will come up with different colors for it. So I'm super excited about that. I'm not gonna close it all the way yet because I'm gonna use one of my items for it. And then this item is really, really cool we got a full-size constellation warmer i love this warmer because i just love this kind of thing so i've already plugged it in i didn't even show you what it looked like without being plugged in but look at all the constellations on this warmer ah uh, maybe i need to turn off this light on this side 
Oh, and it reflects on the wall. There's a moon, there's a Big Dipper, the North Star, all the little things. All the different constellations, the Milky Way. You'll have to get a little book out to, to decide which, what constellations are on here. This is a great warmer. It is dark blue, so I'm gonna turn it off. Let me turn this light back on so that I can show you what it looks like up close. Let's see, let me get this light kind of over here. So it is like a midnight blue. It's got a nice big dish and it's white on the inside with a 25 watt bulb. It's got your classic notch so that it could stand flat on any surface. And it's just a beautiful warmer. And I love this one. I gotta tell you a quick story. When we were coming back from San, um, Sensi Family Reunion, coming back from the airport, and we were uh, getting off of the shuttle that brings us back to our car from the um, terminal. Um, we were getting our suitcases out, but our suitcase with all the Sensi items was still in the shuttle. We weren't done, but the guy closed the door and took off. And my husband ran, ran after the shuttle, and he was only my constellation warmer. So I know he loves this constellation warmer. He was kind of upset about it that it might go missing. We did wind up getting it back. We got the whole suitcase back with all of our sensey stuff, but it was almost all gone. And this warmer is fantastic. It is great. It would be great in an office, in a kid's room, just anywhere. It's a beautiful warmer. So, highly recommend. So there we got the Constellation warmer. Now I'm trying to figure out where I'm gonna put this one because I'm in love with that warmer. So now we are get, gonna get into some of the scents. I do have to mention that Scentsy is very, very serious when they say that you must be in your seat when they are going to do a giveaway and you are to get that giveaway. Now, we missed out on a giveaway. Um, we aren't, we're sad that we missed out on the giveaway. We're kind of bummed, but at least we don't have any kids, so it's not that big of a deal that we didn't get it. We missed out on the Kevin Sensi Buddy, the Minion, because I was having some anxiety about catching the bus to Universal. I was a little bit stressed out about that and I had to go to the bathroom and I was afraid that we were gonna miss going to the bathroom and catching the bus. I don't know why I was afraid about that. So we left a few minutes early to go to the bathroom and to go down and talk to the bus drivers. That's all I wanted to do. And while we were doing that, they did the giveaway for the Kevin Minion and we missed it. And my friend, who's had stayed back home, was texting me, did you get the Kevin? Did you get Kevin? Did you get Kevin? And I didn't know what the heck she was talking about. And I later realized that we didn't get the, the Kevin Minion Buddy, which kind of also was a bummer because we were going to Universal that night and we missed the opportunities to get a lot of the photos that people were getting with their Kevin Minion Buddy. Um, with the actual live Kevin there and are all around Universal. But anyways, you live and you learn. So for the next one, we will know better. Anyways, so now we're gonna get into the scents. So we did get this banana nut bread square. Let's see if it'll, um, if it'll focus. I don't know why I'm having a hard time focusing. I guess I'm gonna have to figure out this camera and how to get it to focus better. 
<laughs> Maybe I gotta go like this. Ah, there we go. So this wasn't actually a giveaway in any of the sessions like we got everything else. This was when we took the tour of the history of Scentsy. It was like a museum that we walked through and they showed us how they used to make these wax bars. And they used to use the plastic jewelry cases um, that you can still buy today. And they used to use these tins and the wax and um, the, uh, what do you call them, crock pots to warm these things up. And they would hand pour them into these jewelry uh, little boxes that had little squares this big and then they would put them in the fridge <laughs> and then they would wrap them up and put a label on them that were perfectly made labels so anybody who took that tour and went got one of the banana nut bread and i almost don't ever want to use this because i want to have this piece of history as just you know a piece of history that i don't want to touch and use so we got one of those, and that was one of the first scents ever for Scentsy. I think they said there was like three. Thunderstorm was one of them, and I forgot what the third one was. And so the next thing is that we got, and I don't have the descriptions of these. Maybe I do for this cherry chestnut. Um, yes, I do for cherry chestnut. We got uh, Cherry's Jubilee pods and I'm gonna put those let's see if I can get this up here ah, cherries jubilee and we got these pods mmm I'm liking cherry more and more we got those I think we got them um, well we must have got them when we got the sensi go which I'm gonna put them in here right now I really like this scent, so I'm going to put the top on. <laughs> I hear it going. I'm going to put it down and see if I can start smelling it pretty soon. We also got, with our Constellation Warmer, uh, a wax bar of cherry chestnut, and this is in the 10 new releases. So we did get testers for the 10 new releases as well. And I will quickly go over those with you guys. And I, we did get uh, some catalogs as well. And this is what the new catalog looks like. And I'm going to go over the new scents with you really quick. I'm not going to go in depth, but... I will just pick them up one at a time. We got Alpine Escape. I don't know if this will. Uh, Alpine Escape. Oh, this I'm not getting a smell yet. Oh, okay. It smells. Uh, it smells like it'll be Christmassy, uh, piney, and this is a feel a feel a rush of minty air among spruce and evergreen trees on a scenic mountain getaway then i will pick up the next one is pistachio woods and that's a green one and oh that smells good it smells kind of bakery-ish delicate pistachio and buttery almond on a bed of cedarwood mind you i'm gonna get uh, these all in wax bars so I can make samples. Mmm, it does smell kind of bakery. It's really good. And then the next green one is Balsam Spice. It's greenish. Oh, smells nice. We're going to have a nice Christmassy smell this year. Captivating Cinnamon adds sweet spice to charred cedar and balsam. And then, no more green ones. Brown, uh, brown butter pumpkin. 
That sounds good. Mmm. There's something in there, but whip up a batch of seasonal spice mixing melted butter and brown sugar with pumpkin for a tempting treat. <sighs> what is it in there? There's something in there I kind of don't like, but for the most part, it's good and very fall. Now we have, mm, can't wait to smell this. And, white peach and cranberry. Ooh, this I like. It is a juicy bite of fresh picked white peach with a touch, with a tart touch of cranberry. Oh yeah, that, that's good and sweet. It tastes like a sweet, a sweet peach that you bite into. It, it's really good and it smells very fresh. Then we got the cherry chestnut that that we also got in this bar, which I, like I said, I've started to really like these cherry smells. Mmm, it's <laughs> really good. Cherry chestnut is warm black cherry topped with roasted chestnuts and whipped vanilla. And it's a sweet and savory delight. Yeah. Oh, I'm so excited. Ah, I love all these good smells. I love walking into my house after being out and just ah, smelling these wonderful smells. Vanilla Amber. And this is, oh yes, oh yes, this smells good. It's a rich vanilla cream. That's what I think I like. It's like sweet cream. Mm. Uh, and golden amber infused with sweet rum. And it's a piece of pastry perfection. Yeah, I would say so. It's it's good. It tastes like, like sweet cream in a sweet cream coffee to me. We've got three more to go in this new release. Leaves and lavender. Let's see how I feel about it, because I'm not that much of a lavender girl, though I'm coming around to it. Okay. Soothing lavender and a hint of clove wrapped up in fall leaves invite you to relax. I know which ones of my friends who are going to love this. I've got them pinpointed right now. And then gingerbread pecan waffles. Let's see. Mmm. It's better than I thought. Mmm. Savor all day breakfast with warm and fluffy gingerbread waffles topped with molasses and roasted pecan. This is good. <laughs> that smells delicious. Oh my gosh. They are coming up with some really good stuff here. And the last one is called Hay Rides. Oh, let me love this. I like the name of it. I don't know if I'm smelling my fingers. Oh, yes. Climb aboard with fresh hay and cedar wood and take a ride through crisp apple orchards in this ode to a joyful autumn tradition. I'm in love. Oh, this is so, so good. Okay, so those are the 10 new releases. And I gotta hurry, because it looks like my camera's doing something funny. Anyhow, the next thing we got was a three pack of this Scentsy Sunshine. And this is the only time and place we're gonna get it. I've already warmed a bar. I have one little cube left in here. It's really good. And I'm going to read you the description. So I get a little bit of a scent of, of um, orange Julius at the end there. Scentsy Sunshine Scent is a bright and uplifting fragrance. Perfect for, let me just get this closer to you. Bringing a ray of sunshine into your home. It's a refreshing blend of citrus and floral notes, evoking feelings of happiness and warmth. If you're looking, oh no. 
yeah, we, I don't see, I don't see what all the scents are, but it's really, really good. And I do get a little bit of an orange Julius scent smell in there and it did come in this really cute little purple mesh type bag we did get the three wax bars my husband hasn't used any of his and this really cute packaging and then the last thing let me take a sip of my coffee in my really cute dizzy mug from Disney. Now this, we did get this last, I need to look here. This is called the Harvest Bundle. This you can get from the Harvest Collection. It won't be available yet, but we all got them. And you will get in here five, it's a five pack, and it comes in this really cute bag. You will get cinnamon woods, apple spice season, peaks and pines, berry apple shortbread, sparkling spice citrus, and that's it. <laughs> but if I can, I will take them out really quick and give it a a sniff. Oh, that that's good. It's different. Cinnamon woods. Cinnamon woods have Bartlett pear, cinnamon, bark, and sugared woods. I wasn't expecting that, but it smells really good. I'll have to do a more in-depth one on that later, on all of these later. Berry apple shortbread. Uh-huh. Oh, that smells really good, too. Berry, lemon, clove, and vanilla. Oh, man, I'm going to smell the... The, that's good oh my goodness it, it, it almost smells buttery anything that has a little buttery tinge to it mm. and then we've got peaks and pines which has dewy greens lavender and cedarwood for me this is more like a masculine scent yeah totally got a masculine cologne type scent to me and apple spice season yep oh let me read oh shoot apple spice season is juicy apple harvest pumpkin and sparkling spices yummy yummy I do get the apple in there and definitely spices. And the last one is sparkling spiced citrus. <sighs> yeah. That smells really, really good. And that is sparkling mandarin, black currant, clove bud, and sugar cane. So, yeah, those are all the scents that we get in this cute harvest collection five pack and those are all the fun items that we got from Sensi family reunion it was so fun and i highly recommend and today is actually the last day you can join Sensi for twenty dollars you can join Sensi anytime and consider joining now consider joining later it's just so fun um you can join for yourself you can i don't know it's just fun but today is the last day today being wednesday the 31st for a 20 dollar bill um otherwise we can figure out other ways to help you join at a very low cost Anyways, I will post that below and I hope you enjoyed this video and we will totally go in more in depth later on all these scents and all these items as I slowly roll them out for the fall and winter season. So I hope you guys enjoy that. Have a great night guys. Bye.